Hello, welcome to this video. This one is on uh, color change, and it's a transition metal complex one. Right, uh, when water is added to concentrated aqueous cobalt chloride, the color of the solution changes from blue to pink. Explain the observation. No equation is necessary, but you should include reference to electron movement between orbitals in your answer. There you go. <clears throat> so, I think the most important thing is... Uh, a very brief description of um, of what causes colour. I think that would be, be useful. Okay, well, I'm going to say this. Okay, in an octahedral ligand field. And again, as I've said this many times before, do this at double speed, eh? Um, because I tend to take too long on these. In an octahedral ligand field, <clears throat> the D orbitals in a transition metal complex split into two levels. That's important, I think. Okay. These levels are, you get your best ones. Um, I'm sure you can uh, answer better than me often uh, in these things, but I'm just doing it off the top of my head. These levels are separated by an energy gap of, I don't know, we could really call it delta E. Okay. If electrons absorb um, energy, <clears throat> energy um, of frequency. I'm, I'm not writing this very well, am I? But I'm rushing to go out now, so I'm going to do this quickly. If electrons absorb energy, uh, energy of frequency, oh, right, right. absorb frequency in the visible part of the spectrum, visible part of the spectrum, they... Um, they, uh, I'm looking at this, I'm just, how are we going to get this in? Orbitals, they are promoted, I'm going to say. They are promoted from lower d orbitals, orbitals to higher d orbital. All right, orbital, and the color seen is the complement of the frequency absorbed. All right, now that's not everything, uh, is there? That's, that will get you probably three marks out. Of, uh, sorry, probably two out of three. So all I've talked about is that, and you should answer better than I have here. You should have perfect answers for this by now. But all I've said is, um, very basically, in an, uh, in an artificial field, a ligand field, the deal was also split into two. This gap between the two electrons can absorb uh, frequencies and are promoted from a lower to a higher orbitals. Okay, but if you haven't quite answered the question yet, because there's talking about they've got to say what happens when the different things. Okay, um, when the what is it aqueous? Uh, what do we do? Water is added. When water is added, when water is added. The chloride ligands are exchanged by water ligands. Okay, this is obviously ligand exchange, isn't it? Okay. <clears throat> These ligands cause difference. Delta E's. I don't have to explain that because I've explained it up here already. These ligands are called different delta E's. Delta e's and so different frequencies are absorbed and different colors seen. Okay, that's definitely worth three marks. I've given all the points. Um, the points, I think the answer scheme says that they want some, some sort of recognition of ligand exchange. Okay, that's important. 
another one of this idea of promotion of electrons promotion or the absorbance okay and the third point i think they wanted was you see the complement of the absorb now you've all, we've done this um complement seed we've done this question so many times that you've got to get a perfect answer seriously this comes up too much don't waste uh, don't waste marks here all right so i think i've given enough there for three marks but uh, i hope this helps all right bye-bye